Things have changed, boss. We pull in money, recruits, just to combat Cypher. Rubbing our noses in bloody battlefield dirt. All for revenge. The world calls for wet work, and we answer. No greater good. No just cause. Cause? Cypher sent us to hell. But we're going even deeper. I know. I'm already a demon. Heaven's not my kind of place anyway. Dogs of war for nine whole years. That ends today. Now you're not sleeping, and we're not junkyard hounds. We're diamond dogs. Let them talk. We can crush Cypher, boss. And you can build the army that can do it. Just one thing, Cos. This isn't about the past. We're fighting for the future. There's something I want to talk about. Concerns the running of Mother Base. Come meet me. You came. Go for them, not me. This isn't the time. You came. This base belongs to you now. Make Diamond Dogs the force it deserves to be. Like any organization, we need good people. And we need to make good use of their talents. Miller asked me to lay that out for you. start bringing people in, use this. It's a Fulton recovery device. When you're in the field, use it to extract any soldiers or prisoners you want back here. And we'll see if we can't persuade them to join the ranks of Diamond Dogs. Go on. Test it out on the staff. Anyone you want. First, put him to sleep. You have a tranquilizer gun. <laughs> Extraction complete. It's an otter, boss. You can only bolt and recover someone if they're not resisting it. No dead bodies either. They don't make great recruits. The staff member you just extracted will be assigned to the team best suited to his abilities. See for yourself. Open your eye drawer. Select staff management from the... So that staff member was placed on the R&D team. The R&D team is in charge of developing all kinds of weapons and items that will support you on missions. Take a look at the development list. Select weapons items under the development heading. That's the R&D team's development list. See the item called Cardboard Box? Didn't seem much use to me, but Miller was adamant that you'd want it on the list. The last word in infiltration technology, or so he said. In any case, we don't have the manpower to develop it just yet. We need more staff on the team. Go extract a few more people. You can also Fulton extract individuals you've knocked out. Why don't you try knocking someone out with Let's do this! Don't yeah. 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 Now extract. Extraction complete. Uh -huh. One thing I should mention. A Fulton extraction won't always yeah. be successful. If a person is injured, the shock of it could kill them. And if the weather's unfavorable, well, they could end up going missing. You can determine the chance of success by approaching the person you want to extract. If you want to be sure you can get them out, best carry them to the chopper instead. Boss, now that we have more people on the R&D team, its level has gone up. They should be able to develop the cardboard box now. Open your eye droid. 
Select weapons items under the development. Now select cardboard box and start development. Just be development has finished. You can have the support units supply you with weapons and items you develop. Think of it as your own personal delivery service. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. When you call in a supply drop, watch you don't drop it on your head. Not sure what it's good for, but Mama said you'd know what to do. Try it out. One last thing. The staff members you extracted were all placed on the R&D team, but that was Miller's decision. If you think they belong somewhere else, you're free to move them around. Well, that about does it. You won't make any GMP or find recruits hanging around here. Board the chopper when you're ready for a mission. Open your eye droid and select a landing zone to tell it where to pick you up. Or if you're still in the mood for knocking guys on their asses. Stay around here a while, give them in some practice. Just come pay me a visit.